very sad to see that this is happening right at the time when there's an influx of new users into the Linux community because of what's happening with Windows 10. This is from Reddit. Exobuntu.org might be compromised. Torrent downloads are serving a zip file with a suspicious executable. Now it looks like one of the developers replied, thanks everyone, we are beholden to our hosting environment for upgrades and it looks like there was a bit of a slip up here. It's been worked on but for now the downloads page is disabled. So if I go to the Exubuntu website and click download, nothing happens. They say that they are in the process of migrating to a static environment, which should make things like this a thing of the past, but our team is small and busy. We're always happy to bring on new contributors. Please get in touch if you're interested. And this is the thing about open source software. It's often very small teams that are making amazing contributions to the community. It's very sad to see that this is happening. On Cyber News, we have this warning, users beware ex Ubuntu website serving malware instead of OS downloads. Virus Total has flagged the software as malware as we can see here. They've tested the software as have others. When you download it, you get this weird software on Windows and it's basically malware. As some tech pros have noted, the malware replaces the crypto wallet addresses with attacker controlled ones. However, they say the associated wallets haven't received any Bitcoins or Ethereum. It's likely that the malware is capable of more. So hopefully you and people that you know haven't downloaded this malware when trying to install Exubuntu. I think a lot of us with lots of experience wouldn't have a problem recognizing that this isn't correct. But the problem is new users may not. They may have innocently tried to download Exubuntu, try to get into the Linux community and then get affected by this. Many of us with lots of experience wouldn't fall for this, but I have had comments on my YouTube videos saying, is Linux free? How do I download Linux? Where do I get Linux, etc., etc. I think there's gonna be a huge influx of new people into the Linux community. We should all help them and welcome them into the community and not to look down on them for not understanding a bunch of technical things. They may fall for this. I always say the following, we all started at zero. At one point in our lives, we didn't know what Linux is, we didn't know what Ubuntu is, we didn't know what Exubuntu is, etc. and make the Linux community larger, teach people how to get away from locked in operating systems and learn about open source operating systems like Linux. What are your thoughts about this? Did you try this? Did you see this malware? Or is this something that you've just heard about? Let me know your thoughts about your favorite Linux distribution. I use Arch, by the way, or do you use something else like Omachi, which is making the news a lot at the moment. What's your favorite Linux distribution? Let me know.